not picked up the camera in so long like almost a year if you've never seen me before or it's been a long time my name is Madison I am a senior at the University of Alabama now first video of senior year first video of 2023 I think and I think I've decided I want to vlog again it's Wednesday September 13th it is 10 30 I'm leaving for class in like 10 minutes I have a dog now she is sitting in her kennel with the door open because she just likes it in there I live in an apartment by myself which is like one of the best college decisions I've made so far having my own space has like fully changed the game so I'm so excited to finally start creating content again because I have definitely missed it bear with me because I'm not used to this right now I've been super active on TikTok for the last few years now um so it if you are coming from there, hello. I hope that this gives you a little bit more of a glimpse into my day-to-day -day life, but I need y'all to meet my dog. She moved in last week, so it's still new, but I've had her for six months now. She's lived at my house in Texas, but she's still adjusting to the apartment lifestyle. Um, her name is Dakota after Jack Prescott, but she mostly just gets called Coco. There she is. <laughs> I'm gonna go to literature. Super fun. It actually goes by really fast because it's only a 50 minute class. Just went to class, took Coco out. She is getting more and more resentful every single time I take her out to go to the bathroom. She like won't go. She's not having accidents, which is great, but she just doesn't like to go outside. I have to carry her and she's kind of heavy. Class was fine, but she can like tell that people aren't doing the reading before discussions. So now we're having an assignment due every single class like analyzing a quote from the reading, which sucks. I don't have class on Friday though, which is great because I am flying home and I'll be giving up my title. I'm a local title holder in the Miss America organization. I've been competing for like the last five years. I'm currently Miss Colleyville, competed at Miss Texas this summer. I am crowning the next Miss Colleyville, so I'm excited to go home and see family. I'm going to see my friend in a show that she's in, but I do have to leave Coco with a dog sitter. But we did meet the dog sitter yesterday and it was great. It went well. She wasn't super shy. She's usually very, very shy with anyone. She doesn't really know, so it was fine. I must give you all my current hyperfixation snack. I just finished this bag, but these spicy queso popcorners are so good. Spicy hummus and pickles. I am such a pickle girl. I always have been. When I was little, I would get like pickle snow cones, which I know you probably think it's nasty, but um, I love it. So my dog right now, she's so cute. Every time I sit at my desk, she's at my feet. It's so cute. I ordered road glazing milk because my friend Grace uses it and her skin has looked so, so glowy. I wanted free shipping. So I also got one of the lip balms and it just got delivered. So I need to go down to the leasing office. Package secured, gonna make a TikTok unboxing and then I'll show you all. Here is the glazing milk. I will test it out and let y'all know what I think, but I'm hoping that my skin looks like Grace's when I, when I use this. This is the peptide lip treatment in the flavor Road Vanilla. Okay, well, it smells amazing. It's a little grainy, which I could have gotten a bad batch because I've heard that that was happening with some. We'll see how long this lasts on my lips because that is a big factor for me. Also just filmed a Kendra Scott unboxing. I'm an ambassador, so I get a package every month. And this month's pieces are so cute. They have color in them, which I don't usually go for, but I'm so excited about these. This necklace is layered, so I keep getting it tangled. So it's just this gold layered necklace. I love how this is like that. I don't know what it's called. That whatever kind of chain stone is like a blue green color i don't know if that focused there's also a matching bracelet it's this cuff and it has that same green color and then also like an orangey coral which i also love two of my favorite colors there we go very excited to add these to the rotation. I am watching the new episode of Pretty Basic on my TV. They're talking about Remy and Cal's engagement, which I'm so excited about. I'm drinking my Cosmic Stardust Alani. This is my favorite flavor of all time. Literally nothing tops it. The red stuff is still on my lips, so that's great. Also just found out that Zoe and Alfie got engaged, which if you guys know Zoella, she's like an OG, OG YouTuber. They have one kid and one kid on the way now and they've just been together for forever they're british i 
have always loved them but recently like found a love for zoe's vlogs again it's a great day i have this massive planner that i got in pr but i love it so much because it's like very detailed i need to figure out what i still need to get done i gotta write some thank you notes so i might start doing that i need to pack to to go home i don't know i've just wanted to relax so bad so all i want to do right now is lay in my bed this weekend was crazy because my family was in town and we had a concert on friday and then game day on saturday which is a whole day full of festivities so i am so tired i'm still recharging my social battery also idea i have my friend and i used to have a podcast we did it for like a few years but we don't do that anymore and then i had one but i only did a few episodes of it it was just me but it was about my um community service initiative for miss texas and that was this summer and i liked doing it a lot i think i want to rebrand it into my own um just lifestyle podcast because i've been so into podcasts right now i i have been for a long time but i've even been like putting them on my tv instead of watching tv lately i'd have my friends on as guests i think that if i'm gonna do it i need to get a microphone because i've always just recorded it like this and the quality has never been like amazing i also have this other idea it's not like a business venture but it kind of is that i really want to do but i'm like working out all of the like creative details in my mind i have like a color palette a tentative name but i don't know how much i like it i have a ton of ideas but just figuring out how to like execute it is hard at least i'm like being creative again i'm vlogging i'm being pretty active on tiktok and podcast and everything so we'll see what happens i also have a name for the podcast that i have always wanted to use for something so i am pumped thank you notes done these are for all of the miss grapevine and colleyville sponsors i need to go to the post office and get some stamps i'm probably just gonna chill for a little bit i have a call in an hour and a half and then i'll probably work out after that so as you guys know She's like such like a like sweetie pie. Oh, I am so tired. Hold on, let me pause my vlog. Daniel Carolyn posted an hour long New York Fashion Week vlog, so I watched that. 5.30 now, I took a nap, which I hate doing, but I was so tired and I still am. I have just been so low energy. I'm gonna drink this Alani. It's called Balance Powder and then also BCAAs and L-glutamine. I'm gonna go to the gym in my apartment. Probably just do like a walk on the treadmill and then come back and do Pilates. And then I'll make dinner and wind down for the night, which is the best part of the day. Pulled out my AirPod Maxes. I haven't worn them in a long time because I've been just using my AirPods. I can't wear these outside right now because it is just too hot. I'm gonna go for a little incline walk. Terrible lighting. Um, finished my workout and just got back inside. I'm taking Coco out, but she will not go to the bathroom. I don't know how she holds it in because she's not having accents. She might have peed, but I'm not sure. She was being so stubborn the whole time. College is all mom life. It's not for the week. My legs are dying for my workout. I'm gonna make dinner. Made shrimp and rice last night. I should probably make a vegetable with it, but I don't have any. So I'm just gonna do that again. I already have the rice from yesterday because I only ate half of it. So I'm gonna heat that up and cook the shrimp. I am starving. I just do these like frozen shrimp. There's a few left in this bag, so I'm gonna finish it off. Shrimp is cooking. Here is the seasoning lineup the night. I switch it out, but I love the Trader Joe's ones. And I put coconut aminos in there too. And I usually put some hot sauce on top. And there it is. I put the chilu on top. I've also been drinking a poppy with dinner almost every night. So we're doing orange tonight. My mom got me the big Sam's Club pack of it. So I'm like locked and loaded right now. Same with Alani. I have so much. I'm gonna eat this and watch the OC. Hopefully Coco will eat her food when I eat too because she has not been doing a very good job with that. She loves this elephant toy and she loves the little lamb. Right Coco Bear? Time for a body shower. I'm just gonna go ahead and apologize for the lighting in my bathroom. This is what happens when I turn on the main light. So I have this lamp but the shade of light bulb is kind of weird. Got out of the shower and I did my skincare. I put Vaseline all over my face today because I feel like I needed some moisture so that's why it's so shiny. I try to drink peppermint tea every night. I haven't done it the last few nights. It just like helps settle my stomach and helps me sleep better but make sure you check to see if there's green tea in it because that will keep you up <laughs> and that happened to me a few weeks ago. So 
caffeine free peppermint tea i'm gonna do my bible study read on my kindle and go to bed i love a good night routine and i love when i have plenty of time to do said night routine it's 8 45 right now <laughs> okay guys it is thursday now my hair is a mess but i ended up going to sleep at like 10 p.m last night i woke up this morning and it was so difficult for me to wake up even though i had slept for so long i just got back from class i was running late this morning so i didn't pick up the camera i was like three minutes late to class but it's fine thursdays are busy for me because we have our college church service that i serve at and so i have to get there in like four hours i got firehouse for lunch and then I also got another sandwich for dinner and I also bought a, an entire bottle of their sauce because I am obsessed with this stuff. Coco, you have to get off the table. My apartment's a studio so I don't have like anywhere to sit in the kitchen so I always have to eat at my desk. I'm gonna eat and then I need to try to get a few things done before I start getting ready. I'm about to curl my hair. I It's been getting greasy kind of fast so I'm gonna curl it and then let some dry shampoo sit in it for a while before I like brush the curls out. It's only four, so I have quite a while to get ready. I love like a slow paced get ready situation. Watching some vlogs per usual. Hair is curled and I put the front pieces in this little roller, which is not something I do regularly. Watching JC's vlog now. Um, I have so much dry shampoo in my hair right now. Loving this gimme dry shampoo right now. They sent it to me um, and I'm obsessed with it. I use this more as a texture spray. It does not leave any white cast. It's the Alini Chris. They always give it to us at Miss Texas as like a gift. It gives me so much volume, so I love this one. I'm just gonna continue the slow getting ready process. Hopefully get a few TikToks in. My makeup's done now other than lips. I'm watching Danielle Carolyn and I'm too lazy to pause it. I'm about to eat my other sandwich for dinner. I know that it seems like I just ate lunch, but that is solely because I've been so unproductive today. So uh, I'm gonna eat this, take Coco out, finish getting ready, and then head over to the church. I'm leaving. I don't love the fit, but this is what this is what we're at running slightly behind so we're gonna put coco in her kennel and head out okay it's dark but i fully didn't pull out my camera at all in there first of all i forgot it was in my bag second of all i got a little nervous and then third i left my bag somewhere and then just had no way of filming anything fail on my end but it's 10 p.m now i'm going home I'm gonna let coco out and go to bed and then tomorrow we'll be packing and traveling home for the weekend which i am so excited about it is friday now i have so much to do trying to slowly knock things out i have to drop coco off at the pet sitter today and i'm so sad about it so i have to pack her a bag too i'm listening to madison beer's new album that just came out it's very good i've always been a fan of hers and i'm trying to like clean up my apartment a little bit so that when i come back i'm not stressed i should probably just pack first so that i am less stressed my laundry is so loud right now but guys i think i'm able to pack in a carry-on and i have extra room like i can't think of anything else i need right now i bring my massive base bag every time i go on vacation or on a trip doesn't matter if it's like literally one day very proud of myself and then i think i'm gonna pack for coco in my base weekender because that's like the bag i have so it's kind of funny she's a she's a bougie dog i did it zipping this up and then I need to just keep cleaning and I have to take a quiz. You have to go to PetSmart because I need to get another kennel that's like portable. Look at that. I think my backpack should be good to go as well. Here's where we're at. Ate lunch, took a quiz. Coco's stuff is almost packed in my base. I'm so sad that I have to leave her. Hung up on my clothes that need to be air dried and then I'm about to take everything else out of the dryer and put it away. That was like my last task that i had to do here so then i'm going to get the car packed up and head to PetSmart. i also got an alani new package i'm an ambassador so they send me stuff and i also get like an allowance each month and i just want to show y'all they have dog treats right now and they are the cutest little dog treats i've ever seen in my life they're like in these shapes i already gave her one she's gonna get too excited if i get another one out i've never had their greens before so we're gonna try those i've been taking fish oil so i thought i'd try theirs as well there we go um so excited to try those and then i got more of the caramel crunch protein bars these are so good literally like a candy bar and then i haven't tried the rocky road kind so i got those as well we are heading out my bag's ready to go i look disheveled at this point but we're back in my childhood bedroom it was a long travel day i dropped coco off and 
that was really sad it, i literally cried and then drove to the airport which is like an hour away from tuscaloosa i got there a little bit early um got to the gate and we were about to board and then they were like um so the pilot hit a bird when he was landing the plane so now we have to wait at least an hour for the maintenance guy to drive in and clean the bird off of the plane we didn't get in until like 9 30. i am gonna go to bed tomorrow we don't have a ton of plans until nighttime. we're going to see my friend landry in her show but i do want to go to sephora and we'll see what else i'm so tired though my allergies have been so bad today so i'm ready to do my skincare and to go to bed it is saturday morning vlogging in here makes me feel like i am a senior in high school we're about to go see our friends that just had a baby and we're gonna eat lunch over there i'm not gonna bring my camera i'll bring it to the pageant tomorrow but i'm probably not gonna carry it around today it's much later now we saw the baby she's so cute and we went to sephora we don't have a sephora in tuscaloosa so i went kind of hard because I've been running out of a lot of things lately. I'll give you a haul. Innisfree sunscreen. I'm out of my glow screen. It's just so expensive and I couldn't justify buying it again. So I got this one. I also am out of moisturizer right now. So I got Laneige Water Bank. This might be a small version. I don't know. It's kind of tiny. I really didn't need this, but I got the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm, the pink sugar one. I've been using the Road Lip Balm. I ordered it with the glazing milk, which I love glazing milk. I think I actually was vlogging when I got the package in. It's really grainy, and I've I've seen some videos on TikTok where people said the same thing, and they said the formula wasn't supposed to be like that, so they fixed the formula. So it kind of makes me think that I just got a like faulty one or like a bad batch, but I'm still gonna use it. I put this Summer Fridays on for the first time and it smells pretty similar to that road one but this one is a lot smoother and it has a little bit of a pink tint which I like. I splurged on the Patrick Ta blush. I got the shade She's Blushing which the product doesn't really look like it's a color I would use from the look of it in the container but I swatched it and really liked the shade and I think that my rare beauty blush might be expired because it's been laying kind of funny on my skin lately so I wanted to get a new one I also wanted one that was a little bit more of a sun-kissed color because I have a happy it's super super bright pink I have the Patrick Ta bronzer and I just love their packaging so this just like doesn't look like a color I would typically use but it's really really pretty swatched lastly I got a lip liner from Buxom in the shade Dangerous Dolly. It's a really pretty just like rosy mauve color. My mom has been using this and I really liked the color and I needed a new liner. I also really like this because you don't have to sharpen it. Sharpening lip liner is so annoying to me and it never gets as sharp as it started. I'm gonna get ready now. Ready? Here's what I'm wearing. I don't have shoes on yet. I think I've perfected my makeup routine finally. I'm loving this new Kendra necklace too. Time to head out of here. Okay, it's pageant day. I had to wake up at 6 a.m. I'm ready now. I literally, like I tried to open my window to have better lighting and it was dark outside. Here's what I'm wearing to the rehearsal part of the pageant. We had these sweatshirts for a fundraiser and um, they have all of the former Miss Grapevine and Miss Colleyville's. Um, there's me right there. I'm all packed up, so I'm going to go head downstairs and grab a few things and uh, drive over there to start rehearsals. We have made it to the competition. This Yay. is Kinley, Miss Grapevine's team for like, like eight hours. Eight hours. <laughs> um, we're in rehearsal. Set up. Natalie, Miss Texas is team. Everyone practicing her lines. And there's Angela. There's my Miss Grapevine. Hello. I'm fueling with my Alani as always. So low pressure when you don't have to uh, actually compete in the pageant. Oh, court. Yeah. <laughs> I need my mom. Get ready for your close up. This is Julie. She's on our board. Oh, I didn't, I thought, I didn't know I was supposed to talk. Yeah. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the our crowning area. Yes. So hey, guys. Hi. <laughs> this is my teen. It's not my teen anymore, kind of. She's Miss Texas' teen. And she's going to Miss America. Yay! Hey, 
y'all i just got back to my apartment flew back to alabama this morning and then i had to drive and pick up coco she is exhausted she had so much fun with the dog sitter i'm about to unpack i am the freak that like pack unpacks immediately when i get home the pageant was so good my camera died before i could film much there and then i didn't have an extra battery in texas but i'm so excited for our new title holders i have so much homework to do i'm gonna end this vlog and i'll probably start another one either tomorrow or i might take a day off i don't know for daily content you guys can follow me on tiktok everything is madison lane dawson and it's all linked in the description thank you guys so much for watching i had a great time finally vlogging again hopefully i can start keeping up with my channel again but love y'all